Happy holidays from Broadway World. I am Katie Lynch here at Feinstein's 54 Below, and we are getting a sneak peek of their holiday lineup. I think I hear some jingle bells. A jingle bells, jingle bells, come on and jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Zada ba da ba ba doodin jingle bells, come on and jingle bells up. Jingle all the way, oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Sure, it's called Robert Creighton Holiday Happy, um, and really that's the goal for the evening, to let people come no matter where they've been during the day or where they're going to leave uplifted for the holiday season. Um, and I think we're going to achieve it. Christmas jazz is literally my favorite kind of music, like number one. I could listen to it all year long. And then just putting our own spin on some Christmas classics. It's gonna be it's gonna be a blast. I'm tap dancing a little bit, which will be fun. Can't not tap dance here. We're doing a version of Drummer Boy. That's a universal theme of what have you been given in the world that you can share with other people, right? And uh, I'm really excited. I don't know why I've gotten really excited about singing that song. The name of the show is Casey Levy at 54 Below on New Year's Eve. Um, <laughs> just giving you all the information in the title. Fantastic. Um, yeah, the show is going to be a party. That's first and foremost. I just want to make it fun for the audience to ring in the new year. I'm going to be singing songs from uh, my Broadway shows, but doing them in sort of in a, a new way, new arrangements, um, as well as just some great pop songs. I'm doing some of my favorite songs. I really love Old Lang Syne, and I'm singing that at midnight, so we, I will give that one away. Um, there's something kind of, uh, I don't know, ethereal and Christmassy and holiday-ish and yummy about that song. So that's definitely one of my favorites in the set. I, you know, I've heard that thing of like you should, on New Year's, you should do the thing that you want to do in 2018. And I'm going to be singing quite a lot in 2018. Um, and so I'm really glad that I am starting the year off right in that way. And so I hope the audience similarly just gets to feel a lot of joy and fun. Uh, will we get a sneak peek of... No. There is no frozen sneak peek, y'all. I'm sorry. But you'll just have to come see us at the St. James for that. Baby, please go home. I am Joe Iconis, and my show is the Joe Iconis Christmas Extravaganza, the 10th annual Joe Iconis Christmas Extravaganza, to be exact. And it is a celebration of all things Christmas. It's, um, it takes inspiration from classic Christmas holiday specials, so like um, uh, the Pee Wee's Playhouse Christmas special, Andy Williams, Kenny Rogers. It takes inspiration from Christmas movies, both bad and good. It takes inspiration from the Radio City Music Hall Christmas Spectacular. Um, it's just this big holiday variety show where we do a whole bunch of Christmas songs that uh, people know. So we do like, you know, um, Please Come Home for Christmas and Santa Baby, stuff like that. We do a couple original songs. There's characters in the show that people will recognize, like um, Santa and his drunken wife, Mrs. Claus. There's characters who exist only in the universe of the Christmas show, like Mr. Maccabee, the old-timey barkeep, and the sickly British ragamuffin. Um, and it's, it's pretty much an insane, one-of-a-kind, holiday, immersive extravaganza. Every little thing is gonna be alright And so I wake in the morning and I step outside And I take a deep breath and I get real high And I scream at the top of my lungs, what's going on? And I say, hey! The name 
of our show is basically the skivvies. We are, you know, the self-titled and, you know, that's the title of our album and our show and our everything. Um, the skivvies, it's just, it's, it's us, it's stripped down music, it's stripped down fun, it's um, just a, a blast of a party and, and music just all coming together with Broadway special guests and crazy arrangements that are all different genres of music and happiness. Right, what is your favorite holiday movie? It's a Wonderful Life, I watch it every year religiously. Probably White Christmas, classic. I mean, when the thing goes up at the end and the singing, she puts the thing in the tree. Home Alone. Somewhere in my memory. It's the Family Stone. I love movies where like well-off middle American white people who pretend like they're not well-off, like are in a house, and then like some crazy person comes and like everyone's trapped together um, and it's like very like fuzzy lighting and all of the appliances are really nice but everyone pretends like it's just oh everybody lives like this and then hijinks ensue and that movie is the ultimate that type of movie.